In today's grammar segment, we're going to talk about direction words. These words are very important when you give and get directions. Let's look at some. Straight ahead. The school is straight ahead. Turn right. Turn right on 3rd Avenue. Turn left. Turn left on 17th Street. In front of. The flag is in front of the post office. And behind. The parking lot is behind the school. Here are some other words you might hear when giving and getting directions. Go about a block. Go about a block, then turn left. Or, go about two blocks, then turn left. You might also hear miles. Go about two miles, then turn right. Another word you might hear is watch for. Watch for means look for, keep your eyes open. Watch for Main Street. Or go about three miles and watch for a big church. Or go about three blocks and watch for a high school. Finally, you might hear turn on to. Turn on to. Go about three blocks and turn on to Gulf to Bay. Or go about four miles and turn on to Third Street. Or maybe go about four blocks and turn left onto 17th Avenue North. Okay, let's look now at a map of downtown Tarpon Springs and practice using some of these direction words. Let's start here at St. Nicholas Church. How do we go from St. Nicholas Church to the Irish pub? Okay, go south on Hibiscus Street about a block. Turn left on Tarpon Avenue. Go straight about a block. The Irish pub is on the right. Okay, now we want to go from the Irish pub to the Oxford House. How do we do that? Go north on Safford Avenue, about a block. Turn left on Orange Street. The Oxford House is on the left. Okay, and finally, we want to go from the Oxford House to the Greek Pizza Kitchen. How do we do that? Go east on Orange Street. Turn right on Safford Avenue. Go about a block. Turn right again on Tarpon Avenue. The Greek Pizza Kitchen is on the left. Okay, continue to practice these direction words. Okay, the other grammar topic for today is the verb to go. This is an important action verb that you hear in English all the time. Let's look at to go in the present and in the past. In the present tense, we have I go. I go shopping every day. You go. You go to church on Sunday. He, she, it goes, notice 
how for he, she, and it, go, has an E and an S. He, she, it, goes to school three days a week. We go, we go to the beach on Saturday morning. And they go, they go to the baseball game every weekend. In the past tense, go is very easy. You simply use the word went to talk about something or somewhere that you go in the past. So, yesterday I went shopping. Or, you went. You went to the beach last week. He, she, it went. He went to the restaurant with his wife. We went. We went to the baseball game. Or, they went. They went shopping.